Italy has a long and proud tradition of producing fantastic sports cars. Names like Ferrari, Lamborghini and Maserati are synonymous with speed and style. But they're also synonymous with being really, really expensive. So what happens if you can't afford a Ferrari but still want something sporty with an Italian flavour? Well this could be your answer. It's the new Fiat 595 Abarth Competizione. Based on the cutesy Fiat 500 city car, but with a liberal addition of some steroids to give it plenty of muscle. It may look like a small yappy dog, but it has serious bite. Under the bonnet is this 1.4 litre turbocharged four cylinder engine that pumps out a feisty 118 kilowatts of power and 230 newton metres of torque. But it's not just about a bigger engine. The Abarth also gets these 17 inch alloy wheels. Behind them, cross drilled and ventilated disc brakes. What you can't see, Coney adjustable dampers on the stiffer, sportier suspension. And there's also a more aggressive body kit, including this rear wing. All that translates to is a far more sportier and engaging drive than the regular 500. The engine is really responsive, and thanks to what Fiat calls a record Monza dual mode exhaust, it actually produces this raspy little exhaust note, which sounds great. Now thankfully our test car is fitted with the standard 5-speed manual transmission rather than the optional dual logic robotized manual. That's because unlike the jerky dual logic, this 5-speed is a sweet little shifter with its tightly packed ratio so it actually feels really responsive and well matched with the engine. The only criticism I would make though is it could do with a 6th gear just to make highway cruising more relaxing for the engine and the occupants. But where the Abarth really feels at home is when the going gets squiggly, or on these tight city streets. Being so small, it feels really agile. It changes direction so quickly that it is a dream to drive on like a twisty mountain road, or even in traffic, it just darts around. Of course, having such a short wheelbase and the stiffer, sportier suspension does mean the ride is pretty firm and it will crash over bumps. But you know that going in, you don't buy a car like this if you want a cloud-like ride. But it's not just about going fast. The Abarth also has a sharp sense of style. In here are these really cool Sabelt racing style seats covered in high quality leather and Alcantara. This chunky flat bottom steering wheel also wrapped in leather and you've got a G meter and throttle percentage, which is kind of fun to play around with. But all this luxury and sportiness does come at a price. While it is cheaper than a Ferrari or a Lamborghini, the 595 Competizione is pricey for a little car. It starts at $36,500 plus on road costs, which is more than the similar sized Ford Fiesta ST and Peugeot 208 GTI, which start at less than 30 grand. But what this car has that the others don't is that unique sense of style and character that you only get with Italian cars. So if you've always dreamed of owning a Ferrari, perhaps the 595 Abarth might just be the next best thing. <laughs> <laughs>